Raise your hand, we'll get a microphone to you and away we go. Kaya? Hi, Mikel. Um, is the overriding emotion after that game pride at how far your team have come that they can compete with Man City at their own pitch or is it more disappointment at the loss? At the moment it's disappointment uh, because we are out um, and because we could have taken much more from that game and uh, and we didn't and probably tomorrow looking it back um, the feeling that I have is that um, we really competed against them and we made it really really difficult for them uh, but we lacked something to, to win against a team like this. And the Thomas Partey substitution at half-time, was that injury-related or was that pre-planned? Yeah, he felt something um, and we didn't want to take any risk, so he could not continue. Hi, Mikel. I think you've already said that in big matches you have to take your chances. That's, that's how you win these games. Is that a concern for you then, that in the, the bigger matches, like you know, for example, when you play City, y well, your team might not take the chance? We have taken the chance in the big matches this season. That's why we have beaten uh, a lot of the big games. Uh, big teams, but um, unfortunately today it wasn't, and uh, and as well we didn't defend the action well enough in the box um, when I can scored, which he puts it at the full back with the right foot in the top corner. So it's not that much that you can do, but it's not only that it's the composure, especially in the second half when we had them and we had uh, momentum there. We have three or four big openings there, and we have to be more ruthless to put the ball in the net. And, and Pep has also said he was surprised by your man-to-man -man approach, you know, your mar marking. Will you? Consider that for the league game next month? I think it will be a, a very different match. Um, I'm sure from both sides, uh, probably with different personnel as well. So that's it. We try to compete it and, and win today. We came here to win the game and uh, unfortunately we haven't. And uh, the next match will be hopefully different. Uh, Mikhail, just on, I mean, Pep talked quite a bit about the man-to-man. -man. Was that because you, you changed five outfield players? Would, would, presumably it would be a different approach when you're at home against City? I don't know. I have a lot of time to think and prepare that game, the same that Pep would have, and we'll review the match and, and try to do what is best for us and, and, and to try to nullify and, and create issues to the opponent, like we always do. Miguel, I know it's difficult and you've just had a match, but obviously we know there's been sort of talks between Arsenal and Brighton about Moises Caicedo. Is there anything going on there? And obviously the players come out this evening and said he's, he's, he wants to move. I, you know that I'm not going to comment in, in any players um, till anything is done and uh, I will continue like that, sorry. Do you hope to be busy in the next couple of days? As I said before, um, we've been pretty active in the market, we have some necessities and if something else is available, the club is willing to, to try to do it when it's reasonable and, um, and hopefully is a player that can improve our squad. Mikel, just on Thomas, was it a knock to the ribs that he got? Was the yeah, he had some discomfort and, um, and it was getting worse and worse, so he could not continue, he wasn't comfortable to continue. Is there any sort of initial diagnosis about how long he could No, be obviously tomorrow, the day after, uh, he will have to be um, an MRI scan and, um, and see what, what he has. And when you have to take someone off like that, does it underline why you want to bring in a, midfiel a midfielder before the window shuts? Well, we have at the moment the, the injury of, of Mo that has not been possible to, um, to get him fit and, um, and Sam is come in and I think he's done well as well and uh, that's why we have players. It's, it's true that um, Thomas is a big influence and is, is a big personality and an important player in our squad and in the second half we didn't have him. Thanks everyone. Thank you.